dance into victory last week as he sends this one away. It'll be a net of 39. 41-yard punt, two on the return. And the Steelers will go on offense here, first and 10. Big Ben and the Steelers with a first and 10 at their own 17-yard line. Here's Roethlisberger to throw. And his throw's going to be incomplete. He was out there waving his arms, saying, throw it here, dropped it, not a good look. Well, all I can do is just look at him with contempt on that one. As a defensive back, I'm saying, not as an announcer. Just like, really? A little bit of a diva look, isn't it? Yeah, very much so, because I think what happens is he just had too much time to think. He's wide open now. Here comes the ball, and he doesn't concentrate and drops it. Just a gain of a yard there, and now it'll be third down. Sometimes your philosophies get challenged at times you don't want them to. They did try to stick to the running game on the first two plays. It didn't amount to much. And now facing a third and long at the outset of this drop. And that is intercepted by the Pro Bowl quarterback Denzel Ward. And they'll take over inside the 45 at the 44-yard line. On first down, they'll run with Hunt. And he's taken down inside the 30. A good pick up there for the Browns, 15 yards. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think they had three tight ends in on that set. And these guys are punching really well. I use boxing analogies a lot. A lot of coaches have told me that when you line up to run the football, it's 10 fist fights along the line of scrimmage, right? You've got to win your share. These three tight ends, they almost always win their fist fights. Here's second and 10 now from the 29. Mayfield to throw it. Steps away to his left. And he's going to keep it here. And he's brought down, but not before he reaches the eight-yard line. That one a broken play, but it ends up being a good play. The scramble goes for 20. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Call it a loss of two on the play. And that'll bring up a second and goal. Eluding the pressure right. To the end zone, but it's incomplete. Landry the intended target, but now it's third and goal. Now Mayfield on third and goal. And oh, it'll be intercepted. The safety Terrell Edmonds picks it. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Johnson was the intended receiver. Big Ben and the Steelers with a first and 10 at their own 20-yard line. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. Complete to Bryant. And he takes us beyond the 35 before going out of bounds. It'll be a gain of 17 at a Pittsburgh first. One play has him to the 37 here for first and 10. Now Roethlisberger to throw. Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. And they will only muster a yard here to the 38. Back now in Pittsburgh. It's the Steelers with the football, but trailing here as we get going in quarter number four. Looking to throw again on second down. Roethlisberger. He's going to find his running back. It's complete. And he'll be out of bounds after getting this one across the 40. And the Steelers on third down. They've hit four of seven. This will be third and six. And he finds McDonald. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. A Steeler first down on the pickup of 11 yards. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and 10. Here's Roethlisberger. And nowhere to fit that football in. It's knocked away and incomplete. Philip Gaines there defensively. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Roethlisberger will throw. Brian has it. It's a Pittsburgh first down, a gain of 13. 
Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. I'm going to keep firing. They'll throw on first down with Roethlisberger. And he's got his man, the tight end, McDonald. And he's going to get it down to the 33-yard line here. Just a yard on the catch there. It'll be second and nine. And partner, I think that's a great example that not all tight ends are created equal. Because everything was right. Got the completion. But he's not one of the more dynamic guys in the league. So and into the end zone. Touchdown, Pittsburgh. Deontay Johnson, 33 yards. And now they can recapture the lead if they can make the PAT. A very important extra point there, up and good. And they have taken the lead here in this fourth quarter. So that drive in total, eight plays. And it ends with a Pittsburgh touchdown. This is taken just shy of the 10 here. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here at the 30-yard line. The Browns drive about to get started. And there are parts of their last drive they'd like to emulate. And of course, they'd like to forget the ending, the interception. But they did put together, Charles, a nice sustained drive to get him down the field. Yeah, and unfortunately for them, the only thing that matters is part two, right? Because once they threw the interception and finished off the drive, that does them no good to go back and say, well, you know, we had a good one going. Finish things off. That's the only way you can get it done. Throwing again on second and 10, Mayfield. And that is incomplete. A lot of force bearing down on him there. He could not hang on. It's third down. Possibly a turning point. Big play coming. This is third and long. He finds Beckham complete. Baker Mayfield as a rookie three times. He led the Browns back to victory in the fourth quarter. What can he do here in year number two? Looking for more there on first down, but this throw down field incomplete. He was looking for Odell Beckham that time, but it'll be second down. Throwing again, Mayfield on second and 10. Flushed out right. Try to drop one in, but it's incomplete. He was trying to force it into his receiver, Landry, and it's third down. Now they face a third and 10 after back-to-back -back incompletions. Now Mayfield, he can run for it, and he will. Yeah, he will go out right near the 35-yard line. Nowhere to go downfield, but he's able to get out of bounds and stop the clock here with a first down. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and 10. Mayfield looks to throw. That's taken in by Callaway. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. To throw again on second down. Mayfield. And he's got this one complete to Callaway. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. We saw a number of good games earlier today. This one might top all of those. It's been a dandy as we come up on first and 10. Throw it, Mayfield. And he was hit as he threw it there, and it forces it incomplete. After the incomplete pass here now is second and 10. Going to the air again with Mayfield. Buying time to his left. Now he'll pull it down. And he couldn't quite get there. Tackled down at the one. The escapability in evidence there is that one. Good for 15 and a first. They need a touchdown, but also have to be wary of leaving too much time for Roethlisberger. Here's first and goal. They'll try to run with Hunt. And he'll barrel his way into the end zone for a Browns touchdown. Kareem Hunt. His ninth touchdown of the season. And once again, the Browns are back in front. Second effort there. He was determined to find pay dirt, and he did. I think that's a great example of what coaches talk about, a back that runs behind his pads, and he uses pads to get him into the end zone. Here's Mayfield. And he's got it. 
So the two-point conversion is good, and they add on to their fourth quarter lead. And of course, on the two-point try, had the option to run or pass. They pass it there, and it works. Felt pretty straightforward, didn't it? An open receiver, ball's put on him, two points for them. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. And they had to wait a long time to get the football back. Probably not what you were hoping for when you got an offensive summit. Agreed. What you were looking for is the defense getting the ball back pretty quickly, right? Hoping for a three and out. So that didn't happen. You can't yell at your D for that. They've got to take care of their own business and reestablish themselves now that they're back on the field. I guess they're in a situation now, fourth quarter, where they're forced to take some chances, but I don't know that that was the type of a chance you want to take. And that one could very easily have been intercepted, and if it does get picked off, that could possibly seal this one. The throw over the middle, taken in, and they're able to get this one across the 35. We've got a one-score game with inside of two minutes remaining. To the Steelers with the football as we get you reset. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. He's back to throw. They'll find Juju Smith-Schuster. And he finally goes down at the 23-yard line. A big play. Smith-Schuster on the throw from Big Ben. 41 yards. His throw incomplete. James Washington was the intended target. And now it's second down. The way he's throwing the football today, almost a surprise when he doesn't complete a pass like having there, but he needs a few more to get his guys downfield. Well, the way he's throwing it leads him to believe that he's going to get those completions. That means the guys going out for passes, they'll run even harder because they expect it as well. Six yards is the pickup, and that'll lead to a third down. They face a third and four after that last completion gets them six. They'll look to throw. And yes, complete to the tight end, McDonald. And they'll get him down about three yards short of the first. Good defense holds him to only a yard, and it'll be fourth down. First things first here, they got to pick up the first down. And remember, it is fourth down, so they've got to pick up a completion here. Otherwise, this one's over. They keep the game alive, at least for the moment, as it's a first down. I'm all surprised right here. They've got three timeouts left. The clock's running down, and they aren't using them. Those timeouts do you no good at home. Use them now. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. Back to throw. And this is going to be incomplete. Now we're in the situation where the quarterback's got to take full charge of his head. Got to totally command and make sure all eyes are on him. All focus is locked in. Going to call multiple plays and go over different situations and scenarios to make sure everyone is on the same page. Meanwhile, on third down, they take a shot at the end zone, but it's incomplete. Down seven, and they've got to go for it here on fourth down. They're going on fourth down. It's Roethlisberger. And his ball is caught. It's a touchdown. And now in the final seconds, they're a PAT away from likely getting this thing to overtime. Obviously, the excitement level here is almost a fever pitch. Down one is tempting to go for two. <laughs> They had to go to the monitor, get an extra look. That's what the technology is for. And this touchdown will count. A very important extra point there, up and good. And we may very well be headed to overtime. So right back to square one, tied at 28 as he kicks it away. This is fielded at the chalk of the 10. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. Now a final chance to stop it here as a timeout comes in with 10 seconds left in the game. The Browns drive about to get started. They have a little bit of time here to get into field goal range. Not much. A tie game. You don't want to do anything crazy, right? I agree with you. It's caught inside the 25. And now they're going to get the timeout. So a huge play has them in field goal range with a chance to possibly send this one to OT. 
And this one is right through. And it's pandemonium in the dog pound. As the